Hello guys, so we are now in Paris at the Syrian Community Conference and great meeting here with Jeremy Moussigi, he is great head of growth at Balanza, it's an automated portfolio manager protocol and can you tell us more about yourself, about your journey in crypto, how did you know about it, so which year did you start? Sure, um, I've been a tech entrepreneur since 2010. Um, I co-founded a couple of uh, consumer tech companies in the advertising industry and in the uh, personal wellness industry. <clears throat> and uh, I discovered Bitcoin in 2012, um, just you know by randomly reading some some kind of forum post or article, and uh, got involved in crypto as an investor in 2013. Um, I've also been uh, involved early in Ethereum, going to very early meetups before the mainnet launch um, and going to early uh, Bitcoin meetups and staying involved uh, ever since. Um, I started uh, a, an investment fund called Immutable Capital in 2018, which um, I still manage today and I've been head of growth at Balancer Labs uh, since 2020. And where do you invest currently with your fund? Into DeFi projects? Yeah, it's mainly, uh, main primary holdings are Bitcoin, Ethereum, and DeFi protocols. And uh, any of your favorite projects for now in DeFi? Uh, I wouldn't want to name any favorites, but I mean, I think there's uh, a lot of innovation in the space. And, you know, I have uh, sort of a, a, a combination of, of, you know, what I would consider blue chip projects and more uh, nascent uh, startup projects. Interesting. And uh, let's switch more uh, about talk to Balancer. Can you tell uh, what's uh, what's going on now with Balancer? What's kind of news you have? Sure. Um, so Balancer, uh, we recently launched uh, V2 of the protocol uh, in May, um, and since then we the team has been rolling out um, various features. Uh, most recently, we launched Stable Pools, which are uh, very similar to Curve's uh, formula for uh, liquidity pools uh, that are designed to hold tokens of uh, same or very close value. Um, that So now on Balancer V2 there are three different types of liquidity pools including um, stable pools, weighted pools, uh, which are essentially the same logic as Balancer V1 where you have liquidity pools that can hold multiple tokens uh, up to 100 uh, in one pool with uh, weights, with each token having a maximum of 80, uh, 98 percent weight and a minimum of 2 percent weight. Um, and uh, we're, we're going to be launching uh, liquidity bootstrapping pools on Balancer V2 very soon. And um, another pool type that uh, is currently live on the protocol is Element pools, which were built by uh, the Element Finance team, um, which is uh, sort of the core infrastructure that allows them to offer their product, which is fixed yield assets in DeFi. And what's your favorite pool among Balancer Pools? Uh, my favorite aspect about Balancer Pool is that anyone can design their own custom logic for any liquidity pool. So um, there are multiple teams currently working on this. Um, Balancer is designed to be as open and flexible uh, and permissionless as possible. So rather than creating a rigid uh, AMM design um, for everyone to follow. We um, uh, designed it more as a platform for uh, innovation and development of um, all kinds of ideas and all kinds of um, custom price curves and, and um, invariants that can serve different use cases and can really create a, a very powerful ecosystem around the Balancer protocol. Great, and I know that uh, you have recent partnerships with Polygon and Algorand. Can you tell us more about this? Um, yeah, we've been working with Polygon, um, and we've deployed Balancer V2 to Polygon um, based on you know demand from users uh, wanting to trade in a low-cost environment, uh, which of course is very reasonable. And um, we're working on a, an Arbitrum deployment as well, uh, which will be coming soon. And um, you know, there are other teams out there that are uh, developing instances on Balancer on other uh, layer one chains. And uh, you know, we have different, you know, some of them are fully independent and some of them have you know, uh, um, some support from the 
balance our community. Um, so. Any other interesting upcoming partnerships you have for Balance? Um, yeah, we have some very uh, exciting partnerships now with Ave uh, and Yearn. Uh, both are building asset managers on Balancer, which um, will allow them to um, create Balancer liquidity pools that are um, where the, the liquidity, the capital in the pool is managed by uh, their protocol. So, um, for example, um, in a Balancer pool that has Ave as its asset manager, uh, any unused capital, any excess capital in the pool that is not needed for day-to-day uh, -day trading activity uh, will be uh, lent through the Aave protocol to increase its uh, capital efficiency, uh, increase its utilization, and of course, increase the yield for uh, all the liquidity pro providers that are um, invested in that pool. Mm -hmm. um, same with uh, Yearn, which will be uh, using that mechanism to uh, bring more liquidity into their uh, vaults and um, helping their uh, balance or liquidity providers uh, earn as much yield as possible, both from the trading fees that they're earning uh, in the pool and, and through the um, yeah, your yield optimization strategies uh, in the year vaults. Sounds quite useful. And uh, why, uh, why do you see such big trend for liquidity farming? Uh, what's, what are the most exciting things in it for you? Um, what are the most exciting uh, trends in, in yield farming? Um, I don't know, you know, I'm not like the biggest yield farmer personally, uh, but uh, you know, Balancer is a great um, tool for teams that are, uh, especially teams that are launching a new uh, token. Uh, one of the most popular uh, tools out there is, is LBPs, liquidity bootstrapping pools, um, as a fair launch mechanism for conducting an IDO and getting your community involved in, in purchasing your token at a fair price, distributing your token to a, a wide uh, community. Um, and after that, um, there are great opportunities to uh, create a yield farming liquidity pool to build liquidity behind your token on Balancer. Um, so we're making it as easy as possible for teams that uh, conduct an LBP to then migrate their liquidity into uh, a Balancer pool that uh, can be providing both their own token uh, for you know, yield farming incentives and um, the Balancer token as well, uh, based on Balancer community approval process. Mm -hmm. um, and, and this is also an incentive that um, we're working with the Gnosis Auctions team on, where uh, projects that launch their token through Gnosis Auctions can also um, you know, follow this route where they can easily migrate liquidity uh, onto a balancer liquidity pool and um, earn BAL rewards as well as um, you know, provide their own uh, token incentives to, to LPs. And both of, both of those are all just meant to like, give teams a really strong opportunity to um, build liquidity, long-lasting liquidity behind their token as soon as they uh, launch it. Great. And uh, what are the plans for development of balancer? Can you share with us? Yeah, so um, a few things that are coming soon are um, uh, asset managers, um, and we are, uh, you know, we'll have a deployment with uh, Arbitrum coming soon. Um, we have, you know, various uh, community um, proposals that are being discussed uh, that'll bring value to the uh, Balancer protocol in various ways. So for anyone who's interested, I highly suggest. Um, checking out our Discord channel or our, um, our Discord server or our uh, forum, our Discord forum, where uh, all the uh, up-to-date uh, stuff is there. That's cool. So waiting for the news <laughs> and new updates from Balancer. Thanks for a nice conversation. Thank you.